And what's up everyone, this is Adam of Landed Productions and welcome back to Pokemon Forest Guy Nuzlocke Challenge. Uh, I, in between parts I cleaned up the uh, Route G over here. I thought that was the same as Route C, but I apparently read that wrong, but I'm not going to go and capture a Pokemon over there just because I don't think that there's anything good. And I already walked out on one, so I would be violating the rules. Anyway, let's uh, go back to the first city because there you can buy Shadow Mail. Or not Shadow Mail, uh, Orange Mail. I think you can also buy Shadow Mail, but that's what we need to finish the side quest. And I believe that's where you progress because Route G is just a dead end, so. That would make sense, at least, that you would progress there. Okay. Oh, I found a pearl. That's cool. I don't know if that's possible to just find a pearl uh, laying there. Laying under a rock. I guess it is. Maybe someone left their pearl in there. Under the rock. You know, they like tripped over a rock and their pearl fell out or something like that. That could happen. I guess. Get out of my way, lady. Jeez. Anyway, we already traveled through here, so just keep running. Ugh, oh, come on. Screw you, little dad, you piece of crap. Yeah, so, uh, Penny's one level away from evolving, so that's cool. Uh, almost there. Okay. at Route A. Might as well speed this up a bit. There we go. So we're back in small town. And can I buy the mail from the Mart? Oh, okay. Orange mail. So we need five of those. And we need a shadow mail. There's a trading place. And I don't know when I'll turn that in, but, uh, I might as well have it in my inventory. So here's Route D, so we have a chance to get a new Pokemon after we dominate this trainer over here. Lotad, okay. Just use Pound, I guess. I can just, oh, okay, water gun, shroom, oh no, I have pack for shroomish, so, since that's super effective, come on, oof, man, okay, well, I'm switching out, screw that, <laughs> that was a close one. Oceans now. Get Penny back up. Cause I don't feel like going back, so. Let's do that, and let's see what Pokemon awaits us. Da -da. Ooh, a uh, Mareep. Okay, so let's try not to kill this thing. I'll try not to kill this thing. Ah, of course. It's just not Penny's day today. Let's bring out, uh, fuck this, so I can just 
hit it once and hope that it doesn't die. I don't wanna screw this up. Okay, so that's good enough. Uh, that's, that's good for whenever I get a fire type. I forgot to check what uh, charcoal even does. Got that. This part, I think. Or no. I got that when I was cleaning up the trainer, so. Ugh. Oh, it looks like he's dead. Well, at least we get to create a death box now. That's fun. Okay, you can take hits, Sly. Or Sill. Yeah, I'll call him Sill. That's cooler. Okay, catch it. Yes, okay, so we got Marie. Cool. Now we gotta nickname it. I'll uh, nickname it. Hmm. I got it. I'll name it Wool Smith. <laughs> How funny is that? Get it? Cause it's a wool type Pokemon. So Wool Smith. Okay, so we finally got like a Pokemon that's a type. Well, I don't know. That's like somewhat unique. I guess I'll call it. I don't know, just getting zigzagoons and pat rats sucks, so... Let's just keep running. Oh, and Ekans would've been cool. Whatever. Just keep running.
Whoa. So it's a print plot. Okay, so I believe now it's part steel type, so it's gonna start learning these types of moves. Um, whatever the pound. So that's cool. Get steel moves now. Now it looks like that's the entrance to the next area. Bug forest. Okay. Oh, I think in the next part I'll I'll tackle the bee bug forest. Uh, so I'll see you next time.